What's poppin' everybody? This is Sable Final Four, bringing you guys another TCG Online match in Expanded uh, using Weavile GX Dark Box. Uh, still climbing up the ladder, still winning matches with this deck, serving me very well. I've managed to unlock a lot of stuff with it, and it's always great when you can climb up the versus ladder, the more games you win, you know, the better stuff you unlock, like they leave the, the better rewards sort of uh, in the later half of the ladder like as you climb it up you get better stuff you need to win a lot more matches but that's how it goes so open up with a uh, double sneezel so got both of them and my opponent opened up with this galarian zigzagoon uh, kind of a dangerous thing to see and expanded um, you see it it could mean a lot of different decks uh, usually not not easy ones uh, but it is what it is we got a uh, well I I don't I can't say that I really like my hand. I've got the Juniper, but if I use that, we lose Max Potion, we lose Dark Patch, and even the Fury Belt. So three sort of uh, limited cards in the deck. Like uh, I only have two Max Potion, two Fury Belt, and Dark Patch is valuable. So hopefully I see at least something. Like I see a GX, so we can at least put the Fury Belt on it. Now my opponent played down the. Arceus Diagopalkia GX, centralizing card ever since it has been released in the format. So dominant, I mean, so impactful. Uh, anyway, let me let me not digress and talk about Arceus now. Uh, Giratina, okay, so it's the danger that I thought. And uh, Shaman, drew a bunch of cards. Rescue Stretcher, put the coffin back in the deck. And play another Shaman and draw cards. It boggles my mind how that card is still in Expanded. I've said this so many times. How is that card not banned now that we have Crobat V when there's stuff like the scoop up net around? Anyway, I get a useless top deck, boss's orders, which basically means that I'm just going to be sacrificing another card that I don't want to sacrifice necessarily. But what can you do? We got to go for it. What other play can I make here? If I don't use this, I'm not doing anything. So here's the Juniper. Discard those cards. And uh, Jesus Christ. <sighs> what are these awkward ass hands? Okay. Uh, gonna use the Max Elixir. Just one. I'm not gonna use the other one. And uh, I guess we can go for the Sneaky Crush. At least discard that guy's Double Dragon Energy. Uh, he made a mistake since he knew he was playing first and I was going second. I don't know why he attached the energy. He should have saved it. I mean, I was definitely going to go for the sneaky sneaky ambush attack, whatever it's called. Uh, so, Roxy. And it's going to get the double plus, unfortunately. But I guess it's better now that I only have a few Pokemon instead of uh, spreading to a big bench. But we got to do something, man. I've got the Chorus, but... If he doesn't play any more Pokemon, he's not going to give me that many cards. Just five. Uh, scoop up net, and here, here it comes. These ridiculous overpowered combos. Uh, going to promote the uh, Arceus and go for the GX attack. Okay, I guess he didn't. Oh, he didn't use uh, Shaman again. I mean, he he scooped up the Zigzagoon. So yeah. Now we're going to go for Chorus, just five cards, and uh, I, I, I don't know how I'm going to win this game. Like, I seriously don't. This has been like the third, uh, like not third, like this my second turn. I uh, used the Major Supporter, and I'm not getting anything. Like, where are the Cherish Balls? Where are the Pokemon? Ah, damn it. It always pisses me off when shit like this happens. Like, what are the odds here? Um, I've got the end. I guess if he kills the Sneasel, I can use this dude to an effect. But he's going to get two prizes for free here if he does that. So goes for the Fear Blower. Um, honestly, it doesn't really matter. Because the Fear Belt, you're not supposed to put it on the Sneasel. It's going to evolve into Weavile GX. Got rid of my stadium too. Um, if he's not going to play any stadiums of its own, then that's fine. Um, the shadow circle doesn't really work against this deck. 
it's meant to be used against uh, fighting decks and stuff when they can hit us for weakness. But fortunately, he has a little bit of bad luck himself. I guess he couldn't get another energy. Uh, looks like Sneasel putting in some work discarding the first one, the double dragon one. So he couldn't attack, and that is kind of huge. Now, I've got the end. I'm definitely going to use that. It's going to hinder him. Not going to play the stadium. I was tempted to. And, uh, oh my god, I can't believe this. I can't believe this. So still, we got one Cherish Ball, but there's still so many Pokemon that I need to get. And you know what? I'm going to have to sacrifice a Darkness Energy, but uh, whatever. I've got the Dark Patches. We need to use Dark Cry and at least get a major attack going. Because the thing is with Arceus, he's used the GX attack. The pressure is on. Uh, that's how it always is against this deck. They use the GX attack. The pressure is on. They just need a few attacks. They do a high damage. You know, the damage gets boosted by 30. It's very dangerous. And I had to discard a max potion too. Alright, so spread the energies around a little bit. Put it on the Sneasel. So I guess if you want to target down the Weavile, I can keep an energy. And uh, hit Arceus and then hit uh, one of the Giratina Guard Chomps. Uh, it seems tempting to hit one of the shamans and then once you hit it again it dies and you get two prizes but you gotta remember scoop up net is around and they can just easily put it back in the hand to draw cards and then you lose the bonus damage at least on the giratina it probably might stick and you know he has two so he's gonna use the fresh one not the one that I damaged but if I damage the other one too then I know both of them are softened up Okay, so Guzma Hala, I guess he goes for that. It discards the Execute. And Skyfield and Double Dragon Energy. Okay, that's what you want. And there's the second Double Dragon Energy on the Arceus. And then, of course, Scoop Up Net. Reuse Shaman, draw more cards, even though he used a Supporter. Searched exactly what he wanted. Bust it. Plays the sixth or wait fifth Pokemon down, so hasn't really used Skyfield yet. Uh, draw more cards with Shaman. And uh, he can even play more Pokemon thanks to the Skyfield. So Ultimate Ray. Not gonna die, but dangerous stuff. And now he's gonna get a few energies on the other Giratina. So Giratina, it's always dangerous that guy's GX attack that's why I need to gather more energies and I top deck exactly what I wanted I mean I, I would have used the Skyla to get max potion in this case you just have to do it even if I don't search another supporter but I top decked it so it's perfect uh, it's exactly what I wanted so getting a little bit of luck again finally and now we can use the Skyla to get something else indeed indeed so this Arceus is going to get KO'd, and I'm going to hit the other Giratina too. So now he knows that he's in the danger zone, like if I get something like a Tyranidar. So Skyla, let us get... Um, what should I get? Cherish Ball. Or... Um, should we get... Like, uh, the Dene is in the deck, so I could get that and draw more cards, but do you really want to do that? It's a very easy target for him, too. So I'm, I'm going to grab the Nest Ball, and what we want to get is Double, actually. So since one of the things, I guess, Double is good, you know, against Arceus decks where they do this shit with the prizes... If he kills this Tag Team GX, then all of a sudden from 6, he goes down to 2. So, Double V is going to be doing a lot of very good damage, you know, getting his great effect off. So, this is the plan. I mean, there's a lot less risk using it. I mean, I guess he's going to be down to 2 prizes anyway. But, it's even better than something like uh, Tyrandar in this case, because I know that I can just use 3 energies on it. So... No matter what Giratina he promotes, 
I have him in a checkmate position. So he can could very well just use like the GX attack and then target the dude. But I have Darkrai left then and it's the same thing. So oh, he hasn't taken any prizes yet, surprisingly. Uh, that max potion play was really important. So scoop up net, it's probably the billionth time. I mean, just look at look at all this shit. Like how many times he abused that effect. Drawing cards all day long uh, for free, basically. It's insane. And this isn't even one of the worst ways to abuse the effect. Like this is so much worse. The people just draw the whole deck at once immediately. Okay, so plays down the Galarian Zigzagoon. Looks like it's going to target down the uh, Dark Cry. I mean, it makes sense. And now he can get the KO exactly. 270. I, I, yeah, he was going to get it no matter what. But basically, that's checkmate. I've got two Darkness Energies on the field. He didn't mess with the uh, Weavile, so I can easily use his effect and move them. I've got the Dark Patch, got uh, Darkness Energies. I guess let's search the other dude as well. But it's basically my game. I'm pretty sure I get the KO uh, with just two prizes left. I'm pretty sure Double does 240, right? So it's more than enough. So an easy KO and victory for us the dark box deck so very very uh, sort of a close game in a way it's a lot closer than it seems but I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this match hope you guys subscribe to the channel leave a like share this video with your friends and I'll see you guys next time we'll say